get in the truck. Come out. Hey, let's get in the truck. Come on, now. Come on, let's go. Come on, now. Get in the truck. Get in the truck. Come on. Let's go. Get in the truck, Sam. Get in the truck. Let's go. Come on, everybody. Get in the truck. Get in the truck. Come on. Get in the truck. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Precious, you so fat. You can't look at her. Get high. Come on. Right here. Get in the truck. Get in the truck. Get no. You can't go. Sophie, you just can't go today. We gotta get Sophie a treat because she can't go. Her 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 lift ain't so good. Say I wanna go, Daddy. Come on. Come here, so you get a tweet. Eat a tweet. Sophie says she's okay with staying home. It's hot, y'all. 70 degrees, 72 degrees. But I got a fella, Chris Gable, out of Mobile. Somewhere over there is not Mobile, somewhere around it. But he has found some fox squirrels. We're not going in there to try to kill all them squirrels. I would like to eat some. They eat good. They're not a cat squirrel. Let's turn that AC on. I want a couple mounted that come from these dogs. Let's go see what we can do. Y'all want to go? Alright, put your boots on. Jess Christie. 2008 put me out of the dirt business. I had to leave it alone. I mean, it totally quit. We went to get metal roofs off of chicken houses out in Texas and uh, Georgia, Alabama. Had a bunch buying the metal from us. They were using it and making signs to sell them Cracker Barrel. Winston Churchill. Honeysuckle used to be everywhere. You can hardly find any honeysuckle anymore. Winston Churchill, get me your address. I'll ship you a little bit of this fat lighter up there. You will be amazed. Jonathan Happy, there is no crawl space in a solid foundation. Stem wall, the kind of customer calls it. You fill it with dirt. They got header block, L-shaped header block. On the top rows, top course, concrete pours all the way in the block and level, level floor plumbing. I'll get you a shot of that. Plumbing's in the dirt. You don't know. Uh, you don't go back in there. It's all done. Better hope you don't get a water leak. Uh oh, they're breaking up here. Dog. Interstate shut down. I want y'all to know. They have turned around and come back. They are getting back off of the interstate, coming down off the wrong way. I mean, they're over there in the doggone get a, a entrance ramp coming off. Now, I, I ain't never in my life seen the likes of that. They doing it, though. They gonna crash them up. Long, long. I got off. And uh, I'm gonna go around 90. We'll go through pace. I don't know what's going on, but I hope everybody's okay. It's a windy, uh, wind out of the east, front on the way. Uh, weather that while I'm done moving, kind of day. So there's no guarantee on uh, these squirrels by no means. We going hunt. It's called hunting, not killing. Let's go see what we can do, though. Traffic's backed up down here at 90 already. You know, you do these, you know, stuff like this happens. The little old lady standing out here looking at all this traffic like, well, something's happened on that interstate. But something like this goes down and 
you know, you have to ask yourself, do I need to turn around now? Is this, is this not the day to go? The Lord telling me? But, uh, I think we're going to ease on right now because I need a lot, I need a little time just to think. Uh, you know. Thank you, Lord, for this day. I uh, Help us through this traffic, oh Lord, and bless this food. Help us, just help us. In Jesus' name, amen. We're at the red light. Let's say the blessing and eat. Well, I went all the way around. For some reason, they ain't wanting us to get on here, so. This is a backup. I don't know. I don't know what's going on here, but something ain't right. Ike Peters. I appreciate your support. Billy Weeks, I hope you get well soon. We're praying for you. Libby Davis Gibson, I hope things in your world get better soon. Hope and pray. Y'all hang in there. Roadmaster 92, the stoves, I will let go for $1,500. But that's what we got to have per stove. Got two of them. Honestly, they're decorative uh, items. I mean, set whatnots on whatever. Beautiful. Uh, if you're going to use them, you really need to convert them to propane with a, you know, gas logs or just a burner. Big Al out in California. I appreciate your experience, buddy. I can tell you have been around. Bandit X, you are right about the basements. I told my wife, you know what? I said up north, because I told her about the comments on filling the slabs here. That's what it is. It's like, that's what we say. You got to go fill a foundation. Everything here you fill up, especially on that water. You get an elevation. He could have put it and had a pole house, but that's not what he wanted to do. He got above flood stage with his floor by using dirt. I, I always want a basement. I got a piece of property that we've got dug out to make a basement home. Really do, up north of, uh, up north of the state, uh, right up there. We're on the line. But anyway, yes, those basement homes y'all have, cool. Not many here. Christopher Kelly, I hope that the uh, internet come up where you could get your shirt. Um, I told Mr. Steve, and uh, anyway, he's, he's selling shirts. I hope you got that, and I hope you got a shirt, and I appreciate you, I really do. Whispering wind, I appreciate your support. I thank you for the comments. They're kind and sweet. Clarence Wren's pack, you're right about Roger DeCoster. He's still in the game. He's a robot. He'll never quit. He'll never die. That man is awesome. I love me some motocross. Supercross. Hadn't rode, scared to. You know, I did get that bike and and I still look, I watch, but man, I don't want my head to bounce off that ground cause of a motorcycle. I already know what they'll do to you. They come all the way to the Alabama line to get on the interstate. Now, for some reason, they got them stopped going eastbound. The whole interstate is blocked. I don't know how I'm gonna get home, but we ain't worried about getting home, are we? We worried about getting nowhere to these fox squirrels. It's closed both ways now. I left about 10.30, I'm pretty sure. I could have been there by now, but I'm just now getting on the interstate. But none of that matters. USS Alabama. Looks small. It used to be huge. Mobile Alabama. Mr. Chris Gable. How you doing? I'm you good. Doing? John Joyner. We got somewhere to hunt, you say? There's some fox squirrels in there? Some big ones back there. Real big ones. I saw about one. <laughs> say they look like a... That's about this long, for real. That's pretty good. That's huge. I mean, this weather's not perfect, but you can't never tell. i tell you one thing a squirrel don't like, and that's real cold weather. Yeah. They'll stay yeah. burred up. They lay up in there and eat acorns out of the nest, I guess. I thought it was a fox the other day. I when really you seen did. one? Yeah. I hope I we see one. It I was, do. Uh, 
when he run out there, I was like, what is that? What the world? And then all of a sudden, two or three of them hopped across there, and it was like, I was like, man, there's a bunch of them down here. So I told you. Well, we don't, uh, we don't want to try to kill them all, but we do want to try to get us a squirrel, don't we, boys and girls? Are y'all ready? Sassy, are you shaking? Are you shaking so bad you just ready to go, ain't you? Huh? <laughs> never watching me again. Stood there and let my dog maul that coon. Hmm. They don't want to watch some of the coon hunts. Mm -mm. And the thing was, I was really, I was trying to get them, but you yeah. can't, I mean, I, w I wasn't going to get bit by the coon. No. What y'all doing? Let's go get the squirrel. Come on. Go get the squirrel. Get him, Sass. He may have got on the ground on us. He was trying. He was trying to get on the ground. They know at that point that they got to get on the ground. They got to get gone. Uh-huh. Did you see him over here? In fact, last time I seen him was in there. Okay, y'all. Battery went dead down in there, and old crazy me didn't have a spare, but we got soaking wet. It rained a couple times, and bushes was wet. We treed, dogs treed, I don't know, three or four cat squirrels. We never did get up on no fox squirrels. We seen some nests in there like that. I, I thoroughly believe the fox squirrels are there. It's a beautiful farm. It is thick, though. It is thick. They they got I, they did get in there on one, and he jumped. I feel quite certain where we was, but he ran through the briars, and he ran through the brimbles. He ran through places my dogs couldn't go. He ran on down the Mobile River to the Gulf of Mexico. That's my belief. We'll be back. I told y'all, it's called hunting, not killing. We going back to Florida, soaking wet. I'm gonna put on another shirt. Them dogs are in the back wishing they had a blanket. And I see me a little old Dollar General or something, I'm gonna stop and get them a couple, throw them back there. Let's go home. We finna wash them dogs, they got dirty. And they don't wanna ride home two hours in this dog box. So I got them a blanket and some towels and some flea soap. Who's first? Who first today? Hmm? Who's first? Let Tank out, he likes to go first. Come on, Tank. Come on. Tank said that this don't feel right. Says he got no but I took tank first. Did you get a bath? Did you get a bath? I got you some blankies. I got you a towel. You got to go first. You a lucky boy. You didn't know that, did you? Sassy, you're second. gonna be so proud of her daddy she gonna inspect y'all you can bet I better get you good enough and I don't see much dirt on these tires nah, that's my boy that's my boy 
You don't know about that mask, do you? I got it on in case somebody comes messing with us. You next. Come here, one more. Come here, Ty. Get over here. Come here. Come here. <laughs> you like a towel, don't you? You like a towel, don't you? Chris Gable took his hunting, and he's, I feel quite certain there's fox squirrels in there. He ain't lying about it. They're there. I've seen some of the biggest squirrel nests I've ever seen in my life. But we didn't get none out of them. He was pretty good with that slingshot, too. That's pretty good, old Tony. All right, come here. I'm going to put you in the truck. Come here. Don't you get in the front. He going crazy in there. Y'all want to see? Let's put on a light. You better stay in the back seat. I got him where maybe he'll stay back there. You going crazy in there with that blankie? <laughs> he trying to get in that blanket. Oh, me. All right, Sassy. You're next. Sassy girl's next. Come on. Sassy's next. Back precious. Come here, Sassy. Oh, you are so dirty. Look how dirty you are. Show them how dirty you are, Sassy. Say, look at me. I am so dirty. Look how pretty sassy he is. Look how queen her he is. We almost dirty. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna wash these towels and we're gonna put them back in there and they're gonna be ready for next time. I wash them in a bucket outside. It don't matter to me. As long as they dry. See what you got at the boys' tanks doing. Two down, one to go. One to go, one to go. Precious sissy, you're last. This one here is fat. She's fat. I don't think this will be the last time of this. My boys and girls got them on bath, didn't they? I'm going to let you ride in the truck no other way. Not as muddy as y'all was. Bath, oh, come here. Come on. Get in the truck. Get in the truck with you. Job well done. We're going to Florida. Let's go then. I got them boys and girls some Cheetos for the ride home. Didn't I? Here. Myself as well. They got them a bath with hearts, flea, and tick. They had two towels each, but a comforter back there to lay on. Them dog got it made. You heard of lucky dogs? They the lucky dog. Like, comment, subscribe. Caleb says ding the bell. That means you get a notification every time we put something out. Third Daddy on YouTube. They did get after one fox squirrel, I feel certain, off in the pines. He jumped, run through the briars and run through the brimbles, run through places that my rabbit couldn't go. He runs so fast my hounds couldn't catch him. On down the Mobile River to the Gulf of Mexico. That's my opinion, I'm sticking to it. 